Very pleasant. From Fakir Zaman. Over slip, pull his length back and uh, Fakir goes hard at it. Nice shot. A perfectly timed, but timed well enough from a man. Worth the price of admission or your time. That's a superb shot. Got him, Jaden Seals. The short cover fielder was placed after the first boundary. The ball was there. Fakhar Zaman playing with a horizontal bat, not in control. And Jaden Seal gets his man. Mm. Yeah, you can't drift down leg too far. Fine leg is up in the circle. So easy pickings. Exactly like that, and this... Oh, very close. Oh, the nick away, he's gone to the fence, but Azari Joseph had worked his man over. Almost. Almost had Imam a couple of times, and this one, Barber just pushing out, almost carrying to point. That's well hit. Round the wicket, Mears. The outside edge found, but it goes away to the fence. A boundary. Feeling well. And on that length, easy for Baba Azam to put that away. I was going to race into the boundary, pouncing on any opportunity. Cut away and cut away fine. Well stopped at the boundary. Will pick up three and that will bring up his half century as well for Imam Al Haq. Raises his back to the crowd. The local boy gets a huge cheer from the crowd. Pakistan also bring up their hundred. That's just beautifully struck through the offside. Uh, it just eases that over extra cover. Just a little bit of extra bounce. Get him. Having said that. Yeah! There goes a wicket. Goes for that reverse sweep, Akil Hussain. Making sure it was on the good length and no problems with the catch there. Jaden Seals takes a catch. Look at Nicholas Puran. That's edge. Is it going to go all the way? It will. Brings up Abazam's 50. Stopped Rafman Powell. Well, that's gone wide a third man now. Four more. They want this game to go deeper and further. That's a beautiful shot. Just open the wrist at the right time, being able to place it and get a boundary. That's going to go for four. There's the boundary I've been talking about. And straight away he goes for a boundary. Yes, that's a deliberate stroke. Went inside out just to clear the infield. And that will take it to the boundary and there it is number 17 in just 103 balls 
And with this, Babar Azam becomes the first player in ODI history to score three consecutive centuries on two occasions. Against West Indies, two against Australia and Lahore, one against England and Birmingham, that has been his form. And in 2016, he also was able to score three centuries against West Indies. And this time it's Mohammad Rizwan. Full toss. Gets low underneath it and hits it flat. Over wide long on for six. It's up in the air. Mears is under it and the catch is taken. A little fuller length from Alzari Joseph this time. And uh, not able to time it properly. Sky is one to short mid wicket and Kyle Mears does the rest. So Barazam, another fine innings, 103, just 107 deliveries. And it is. Brings up his 50. So even though his start was a little bit slow, he's made up for it. 43 overs gone, it's 245 for three. Welcome boundary. Peace off, peace off, Rizwan could be gone, is gone. Big wicket for Shepard, Purana and the West Indies. It was a slow one again. Again, looking to pull it through the leg side. Just managed to get the top edge. Captain doing the rest for West Indies. Easy catch in the end. It's a good strike. It is a brilliant strike. You could sense a, a tightening of the grip, the bottom hand. Clears the front leg and rides the bounce as well. Always looking to hit up and over. Another one back to back sixes. Missing his length ever so slightly. A slow, low full toss. Gets under it to push the shine. Swings through the line. Three in a row. Three different areas, three different deliveries, and three perfectly executed shots over the boundary for maximum hits. What is man, Alzari Joseph? He's come back very well in this latter overs. The end of shut up. Once again, pace off, just a fine tickle straight into the keeper's gloves. Terrific, terrific from, oh no, that should have been one. Great skill, we've seen the power of uh, Kushdil Shah, now we're seeing a little deflection. Brings Kushdil back on strike. Massive! Single-handedly turning the table here once again, Kushdil Shah. Magnificent connection on that, the sound of the bat. He always knew a sail over the fence. Game over. Mohammed Nawaz finishes it in style. Jaden Seals is on his haunches. Risky option to be bowling hard length here. It's been another fantastic chase from Pakistan. A winning shot comes up in style. The Multan crowd were on their feet, so was Babar Azam and his men. Pakistan winning by five wickets. Ten Super League points.